Hey, what's going on? This is Craig, Craigery B. Um, I'm sick right now. Uh, I caught um, something from the roommate. He had it for a couple days. He missed three days of school. And I just got fevers. Uh, not the worst cough ever, but a pretty bad cough. Not the worst sore throat. What is there? Just, you know, feeling tired. I was supposed to go out and do some stuff in the front yard that's kind of time sensitive today. But I wasn't able to do it, so... I uh, happily watch football all day. Dolphins are off today. But first thing I want to mention is I still have this going. I just haven't mentioned this for a while. Haven't put anything in this. Hopefully this will change in just a little bit here. Um, I have another video I recorded, but you're going to see this one first. Not that the last video is it's kind of boring. I just I didn't play any music. I didn't do anything stupid. But uh, I opened up some stuff, some new stuff. So it's uh, some interesting, yeah, somewhat interesting stuff. So... First things first, I opened something off camera. A 2022 hanger box of mosaic football that I found at Walmart. It wasn't on sale, <coughs> excuse me, but it's like somebody that you know, you're not supposed to be able to do returns. Either they let somebody do a return or someone like myself hit it, it fell behind a shelf and they just finally found it. But I bought that and they pulled the uh, Genesis. So the Kyle Pitt Genesis. This is supposed to be a case hit. This card raw is said $25 to $35, so it paid for uh, the hanger box, which it would have been. Kyle Pitts isn't the worst. I mean, he's probably a top 10 tight end in the NFL. He's just not really special, I don't think. He thought, they thought he was going to be when he was drafted. And um, I got one other autograph here uh, because I had all day to do it. I was sitting around and I ordered two more autographs. So I'm probably going to wait till those other two come and do three more autographs. The one audit, well actually I don't even have it here yet. Uh, it should be delivered though in the next day or two. Um, the, the one that should be delivered first is probably my favorite autograph so far. I like the look of the card, the slab that's in. And then the other two. Uh, we're kind of running out of like, I call them fillers I guess. Uh, we're kind of running out of fillers. We're going to start getting into... You know, some of the uh, not fillers, maybe not the big, big guys yet, but we'll be there soon. Okay. So, someone pointed this out to me. There's a show called, it's called Jerry Anderson Space Precinct. I don't know if it was from the 80s or 90s, but they made uh, also a toy line. It's supposed to be a really, really bad show. I have to find it and look it up. But my last name is Brogan, B-R-O-G-A-N. And on that show, there was a Lieutenant Brogan. I did not know that. So I ordered I ordered a figurine. This is Lieutenant Brogan. He's got two separate figurines. The only one of the police officers on here that have two separate ones. So he must be the main guy of the show. Uh, this is Light Man. Doesn't need the punches still there. I got this for like 11 bucks. And I'm going to order... I'll order the other one. I may even order all the stuff on here, although... That police cruiser looks like it's going to be hard to find. I'm going to get slow-mo. Uh, so it's supposed to be people and aliens in some type of police precinct. Uh, I guess there is some wear on the, the card here. But otherwise, it's actually really, really good condition. My only hope is that uh, Lieutenant Brogan is banging Officer Castle in the show. That'll redeem me there. So... Uh, I'll order some more stuff of that. Probably put it in the wall. Just because it has my name on it. So what I have for you today... I finally found them. I got two boxes of this. Well, actually, the wife found them. Uh, she found them. I, I asked her to take a picture of the cards, card area at Target. I've been to Target almost every day for the last week and a half looking for these. Although, I will say, I think the basketball, from what I've seen online, was a little bit better. I have seen a couple... Really heaters of this, but a lot of them aren't good. No, they're not terrible. They're still worth buying for $17.99. But let's get started. This one has a uh, Heritage Pack. This one has a 2023 Series 1. This one is heavier. <coughs> so I think I'm just going to open up both these boxes. And we'll go through the packs here real quick. We'll see what... We'll, we'll individualize which one's in each box. And then we'll... Open the other one and then uh, kind of just go from there. Hopefully we get something good. A lot of, uh, I saw a couple boxes with 2017 and 2018 fat packs in it. So this is, looks like a heritage box. This is not what we are. I am calling one autograph to the, on this video. 
Ooh, there's a Bowman. I wonder if this, I, I don't know how to tell. 10 cards. Uh, I don't see the hobby symbol. I, I, hope, I wonder if this is um, a dead pack or not. I don't know. Someone tell me. Uh, I don't know how to tell if it's from Blaster or not, or from a, a Mega Box. So it's a little disappointing. Um, it says there's one bonus item here. Uh, eight total packs. It says somewhere about a bonus item. It includes bonus item. And they've been including top loaders. I've seen both one and two top loaders. And yeah, there they are. <laughs> top loaders. You know, I'll say this, though. This one seems to have some spooge on it. Ew. What is that? Is that tape? Like, I don't mind this, but they can't be used. Yeah, it was it was uh, melted in there, so I got one top loader so far. Uh, I don't mind this because, I mean, they could give you a pack worth less than 50 cents what two top loaders are, but I only got one because it was broke. So we got the two Heritage, the Bowman. We got a Topps Chrome. I like that. They haven't announced the MVPs yet. You, it's going to be Otani and Acuna, but the point is that you could pull $20 or, or more card out of this. I know it's only four cards, but there may be more packs. I saw a lot of these with more than... There's another Bowman. I'm just hoping... Just hoping that I have a chance to get something out of that. This is the first time I've seen these from watching these online. Some interesting uh, rips on here. Like I said, some, some good boxes and some not good packs. We have these. I actually like these. I opened up that one box of Panini Golden Age at one time. <coughs> Excuse me. The first time I saw... Yeah, I'm not editing out the cough. Go fuck off. Um, the first time I saw someone open a box of this, they opened up this and there was an autograph in there. It wasn't like a big one, but it's cool for me. I take it. And then we have... So I'm going to give this box... Well, this, I mean, I expect it to be one pack of these. I'm, I like this. I like this. I mean, these these are better. They're 2022, so then there's something in there. Uh, if I knew what these were, I'm going to give this a C plus or a B minus. If someone ends up telling me what those are. So, put that there. Let's do the second box. So, I, I don't think any, anyone will have any argument with me. Um... You can't get anything out of here. The 1991 Leaf set. Not that I'm just trying to uh, get gold rookie, gold leaf rookies. But I'm going to put this in the uh, the football. We got plenty of room. It's not all going to be junk. There's some good packs in here. You know, there's some decent packs in here. I'm going to eventually get to the point where I buy a couple of nice packs and put those in there also. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me, damn roommate. Actually, let me put these in order, then I'm going to open these first. I'm going to open these two first, because I don't know if they're supposed to be there, and then I'll do it like this. I'll, I'll, I'll take eight packs of uh, of uh, Chrome in there. This is heavier, and this is going to have uh, a, a fat pack in it for sure. I can tell you that. This is a heavier one. Hopefully, this is a better one. Okay, so there's it's, uh, 16 cards. Series one, I don't see the hobby, so I don't think this hobby. Uh, here are the two intact. Oh, is that another blemish right there? Do I got another bad top loader? No. So I got two top loaders out of that. Here is the Golden Age pack again. Hey, there we go. We got two chrome packs. I will definitely take that. We got another 16 card pack of those. Uh, this one looks thicker than that one, but... And we also have the Leaf and a third Chrome Pack. Very nice. And a third one of this. So, not the variety you want, but... I think they have more to target. I may go back tomorrow before work and buy more. Yeah, I have to go to work tomorrow, even though I'm sick. Okay, so three packs of this. This, this, and this. So, this is what you get out of these boxes. I'm going to take... I don't want to give somebody two leaf packs in there, so we're just going to open that first. Like I said, I plan on giving that away around the holiday season. I decided it's not going to be a wheel of death. It's just going to be one spin when I open something else at the end of a video. But I will get some good stuff in there. <coughs> Excuse me. 
sorry if I'm just killing anybody, but I wanted to open these. Uh, David Durango. See, David said that the hockey's good. He doesn't know anything about hockey, and I don't, but he said, he said, go ahead and get it. It's not a shilling rookie. Eck. Should be two Hall of Famers there. Kruk. And then Chura stuck to the puzzle. Okay, so nothing crazy in there. No gold cards either. That's kind of a waste. Um, so he's like, try the hockey. It's still fun. And I'm like, you know, it is kind of fun because you don't know what you're getting. But then um, I was going to tell the wife to pick me up one hockey. I was going to do a G-U-Y Le Fleur search. But she found these baseball. So these are going to be what we opened last. These will be second to last. These will actually be third to last. There's a chance. You can get autos, like I said, out of that. Let's put those off to the side. We're going to open these Bowman first because I don't know if these are dead packs or not. I hope not. That kind of sucks if they did that. It does kind of look like it's out of some, at least a blaster. But hey, there's a Gabriel Gonzalez in the back. If we were to pull an auto out of here or like a numbered color, we'd know that they weren't it. Shout out to SW. There's Jordan Alvarez. There's a Matt Walner. I did a break not too long ago that I got the twin and I got a couple Matt Walner, so I know who he is. Xavier Isaac, there's an Averson Ortega, and a first chrome of Gabriel Gonzalez. So I like these. I mean, really, they could charge 25 bucks for these, and they'd be, people would be like, yeah, but at $17.99, they're actually, to me, they're worth getting. Goldsmith, there's a Mas Masataka Yoshida for Dave Durango, we just mentioned him before, Mookie Betts. Daniel Montesina, I thought that was a catcher everyone's freaking out about, but I don't think this is the right <coughs> This is the right one. We got two Bowman Chrome first there. Shout out to David M. I haven't mentioned David M David M's name in a while. I was just thinking about I haven't seen Clint for a while, then I remember David. Uh, whoever, you know, if you watch and you haven't posted for a while, just give a shout out. Post something. Okay. Like I said, I wouldn't personally pick the Heritage, but it's better than the Leaf stuff. I'm still calling one autograph out of all this mess. I did watch one break where a guy had the Heritage, pulled a Johnny Bench auto. Okay. Bryce Elder. I don't know why I'm obsessed with that card. I keep on looking at it. Lucius Fox, Jose Miranda. So we have some rookie cards in here. This is J.D. Martinez. Isaac Paredes, and not a whole lot in there. Do another pack of these. Um, I used to see Heritage all the time at, um, oh, there's a purple in there. We'll get a slow play of this. You know me. I, I, I know that's not an auto, but I used to see this at uh, Big Lots all the time, and I haven't seen any cards at Big Lots in, in uh, shoot, a year. No, not that long, but at least nine months. Can you hear me wheezing? It's really annoying when you wheeze all night long and you can't get to sleep. I didn't see it. If you did, it's really, it's pretty, well, no, there's more cards back there. I'm not looking at it. So if you saw it and it's not a surprise to you, congrats. Hey, there's a Bobby Witt Jr. rookie card. Let me take a look at these again here. Bobby Witt Jr. So a nice one there. Jake Myers. That's not the worst one. Uh, okay. We saw those already. Uh, we'll play that for the end. Uh, don't show it. Well, there's another purple one. Did they get these? Is it purple from a hot box? Am I wrong? Maybe these came from a, some of these came from a hot box. Two of them. Well, did I, I got two of them out of one box? So, maybe, yep, I bet you that came from a hot box. There's a Stephen Kwan rookie. Not bad. There's a Bryson Stott rookie. Got a lot of Bryson stats, but Quan and Bryson Stott, I mean, I hold on to those, so. That's a rookie card, too, I just saw right there, the purple. Solano, Syndergaard, Alec Thomas, uh, maybe a bigger hit a while ago. Okay, so now we're going to shift gears and go to get Ganini, Panini Golden Age. Might as well be Ganini as gone Panini. That's not too clever, but. And there's a spacer in there. Awesome. <coughs> I 
means there's not going to be an autograph in there. I don't think so. So we have uh, we have something going on there. I don't, I'm not going to look too much. Napla Joy. I think I saw this pack in one of the same coalition and one of the ones I just watched on YouTube a little bit. Yeah, I may have to go look to see if they have any more of these. I'd get two more. Hopefully get a different coalition. Coalition, coalition. Okay, we have uh, Dom DiMaggio, Bill Mummy. No idea. We have uh, Butch Patrick. That is... Angela Cartwright, Joey Ramone, and William McKinley. So, unfortunately, no autos in the two-pack of Golden Age. I'd take two or three packs of Golden Age in one box. I'm going to get something in my drink here, clear my throat. It's shadowy in here. Oh, I know what I wanted to mention. I keep on trying to, I'm practicing um, to get it set up to do live stuff. The only way it lets me go live if I have the camera not um, horizontal but vertical and you can't really do it that way. And I keep on trying and that's the only way I can do it. So I'll let anybody know I mean, if I'm going to do it, if I can finally get it figured out, I'm going to do a live stream. I'd love to do that. I mean, not that I'm getting bored of this, I just want to do different stuff. Get a live stream, get people in here. Have people, you know, tell me what to open up, try to do giveaway, stuff like that. And there's some backward cards in there. Oh, because they're all turned backward, Craig. There is a Julio, a J-Rod, you could do worse. Oswald Peralta. You've seen all these before. We just don't really have too much else to, to show you right now. And I just dropped a J-Rod. Matthew Libertor, so that pack was kind of a dud. I mean, yes, it is a J-Rod, but it's not the Chrome. I promised a uh, auto. We're getting uh, getting a little uh, close to not getting an auto. Kepler. Let's go from the bottom. Oh. There's a green in there. Keston Hero. Nothing crazy in there. Who is that? That is a Miguel Cabrera. You could do worse. That is a Bryce Harper. You could not do worse. So I'm going to take this bottom card off. And we are going to slow play the green also. So we got three cards to slow play. That's cool. Uh, we got one more pack left of the base. And then we're going to do the chrome and then we'll do the hits. I'm going to home run. I'm not going to slow play the home run card. I, I like those. They're still collectible cards to me. I think I mentioned that before. It is Jazz Chisholm. So not the biggest one. I still never got the SPs on any of these. The trout. <coughs> Excuse me. I'll go through these better a little bit later. Okay. First pack of chrome. I don't want the video to be too long, but doesn't look like we have anything crazy. Rookie card Bello. Rookie card Dermis. Skin Garcia. We have Lieva Piguero, and then we got an MJ Melendez. So nothing crazy out of there. Second pack feels a little thin. We got insert on back. So Varsho Scherzer. There's an Ezekiel Tovar. Well, you could get worse. And then a Jose Ramirez. So two packs left to Chrome. You don't look like my promise of the autograph is going to come through, so I'm wrong again. There is a... Uh, oh, yeah, I forgot. We're looking for a Cunha and Shohei out of the East. There's a Trout. Oh, we got five cards in here because there's the dreaded Sepia. Although, if that's a, one of those two that I just mentioned, and it is Jock Peterson. 
This card feels Bregman. It feels heavier. It is the uh, it is the chrome. Well, it's the chrome something shiny or another. I don't know. And then Pujols and I mean it's not the worst pack. You got an extra card. You got a couple stars in there. No, nothing in here. These are these are really hard to get autos on. I mean, you only get one. There's an Eloy. <coughs> you only get one per hobby box. So, I mean, they're tough. The only one I can remember pulling recently is the um, Hulu Urias, which is now worthless because he's a fuck up. Give me one more minute here. This is Lieutenant Brogan. Call the rest of the police. We've been robbed. We were given bad cards. Okay, let's do this here. Okay, so we have... Oh, we have a gunner right there. So let's we'll flip the gunner and see who that green is. So it is a gunner. I didn't even notice that before. And the green is, unfortunately, Willie Adamas. And that is out of four ninety nine. dollars So Willie Adamas. And the gunner is the best one out of that. We got a George Springer here and... It's Ivan Castillo. Wah, wah, wah. And then you, you, you see Kikuchi. So I think those are from a hot box, which is cool, I guess. I mean, it's nice to get those parallels. We didn't get anything crazy. So uh, the Bobby Witt Jr., I would say, is for me the best one because I don't know if I had that one or not. Uh, but it was fun. Uh, I, I'll get a couple more and I won't overdo it, but... Uh, I'll look forward. So you're going to see this video before you see the previous one that I did. These will be the next two. I promised a holiday special, but I'm postponing it to a little bit later in the year. And that's it. I uh, plan on getting better and working. And probably the next video will be me coming back with an autograph or so and opening something. Okay. Thank you very much. I'll talk to you later. Bye.